All right. Oh, and hey, we already got Dan Maku in the chat. And hey, everyone, and welcome to Nadia and David's Mega Man Mayhem. And today we are celebrating 35 years of Mega Man. Yay, 35. Holy shit. Uh, where was I when Mega Man was born? What's 42 minus 20, 35? Uh, that's how old I was. Seven? Yeah, I was seven. What? I don't know how to add or subtract. I can add. Sorry, I can't subtract. Uh, okay, are you comfortable sharing what year you were born? 1980. And Mega Man came out in 1987, so... Okay. That's pretty easy math. <laughs> no, so I was good at easy math. So, yeah, um, been big day today for us. Got, uh, let's see, got a relaunch of the Mega Man Network, or at least an updated, uh, you know, style. Now the site actually kind of works on the back end. Still uh, hammering out some tweaks there. Uh, got a new chap, new uh, episode of uh, Legends of the Halcyon Era. That's available, The Girl With No Name. I hope you all check that out, because this one's really special to me. And, of course, the uh, crown on the whole thing is uh, we are going back to where it all began with the original Mega Man. Yeah, this game is torture, but we'll do our best. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, uh, I just, I'll, I'll go ahead and throw in... Uh, gosh, I was, like, living in Mount Airy at the time. Uh, and, yeah, the, uh, the first Mega Man is also the first one I played, so... Yeah, that's unusual. Like, most people played two, I played three, but you played the first one. How did you even get past that box art? Honestly, it was the hype for Mega Man 2, and I was like, oh, I gotta go check this out. Oh, okay, interesting. So, yeah, I, I don't think I was playing it right, like, in 1987, because, like, I didn't actually get my NES until, like, uh, Christmas 88, and uh, Mega Man 2 was around the corner, so it was, like, right in that cycle. But yeah, I, I came back to this, I played it, and I'm like, wow, maybe this isn't for me. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, I decided, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and give Mega Man 2 a try anyway, because that just looks neat. And that that worked, that, that one hooked me, and I came back to this one eventually. I don't think I beat Mega Man 1 until after I beat Mega Man 4. Yeah, Mega Man 1, I didn't get it until after I played and beat 4. And I played and beat 1, I finally beat it on, like, a really crappy CRT black-and-white television that was on the floor, and I swear to God it was going to burn up. But I beat the game first before it could burn up. So I won twice. Nice. Uh, yeah, with... Uh, Mega Man 4 was a tough one for me, and uh, not so much these days, but at the time it was a tough one for me, and when I finally beat that, I was like, you know what, maybe I can do this first one. <laughs> M so. says pause glitch or we riot. Yeah, no, I can't beat the... David says we're going to beat the Yellow Devil. I say, no, impossible. I, I, we are going to try to beat it legitimately. If that's not working out, we're not going to, like, you know, make y'all suffer. So the, then then we'll go to the uh, thing. Yeah, go ahead and start. It's a real uh, active uh, uh, title screen here. And yeah. uh, we got the original six. Yep. So, uh, yeah, I guess let's start with uh, DLN003. Okay, so... He oh, right, the jump button doesn't work for that here. <laughs> <laughs> what is it, the start button? Yeah. DN003, so that would be... Rock, roll, Proto Man... No. Proto Man is zero. Oh, okay. Huh, coincidence? Absolutely. Yeah, it was kind of hard to go back to this after Mega Man 3 and 4. And I think... I don't remember if I played 2 when I played this. I probably did. The only reason I had this one is because my parents went to... They went to Florida, and sometimes they'd bring me home a, a, a gift, like a really good one. And I never expected to get a video game. I just said, like, you know, bring me back a Mega Man game. Kind of like expecting, oh, maybe I'll get four, or maybe I'll get lucky. And they brought back this one. Ah. I was like, yeah, thanks, I think. Are you sure this is Mega Man? This cover looks kind of sus. Mega Man games were such... Gosh, I, I never I never bought them back in the day until Mega Man X, because the hype for that one was enough that it's like, yeah, I want to friggin' own that. Before that, they were weekend rentals, because I'd usually beat them within the weekend. We usually got week-long rentals with our video, and it usually took me about a week, because I wasn't the greatest at action games for much of my life. And, uh, yeah, in my case, though, it's like, oh, the, it'll be at the rental store forever, you know, I can just go get it whenever I want. 
Funny how things change. <laughs> what was that? The run? What are you talking about? This game or X? Oh, uh, just the classic series games. And when I kind of notice, like, you know, things kind of shifting, then it's like, okay, you know what? Maybe I should get a hold of these. So I did manage to find a uh, complete, little worn, uh, but complete boxed uh, copy of Mega Man 1 at the uh, flea market that I still have to this day. Oh, you got that at the flea market? Uh, yep. Back when flea markets had games that you could, like, actually afford? Yep. Wow, retro. Uh, I think another thing also is that, like, I didn't really realize it because I, I don't know, my sense of time is all screwed up, but, uh, games like 4 and 5 and I guess 6 as well, progressively harder to find because they came out at, you know, right at the end of the NES's life. Yeah, I'm not even sure if I'm not even sure if we have a uh, six. I think we have the first four uh, physically, and then of course seven, which you know I made a, a point of because I like uh, seven. you know how that is because like that one's really rare. I'm not sure if that if it's rare uh, or less rare than uh, X3, but it was like you know right in that same uh, window. X3 was the really rare one. Like yeah. even to rent that one was a bitch, but I did it. I remember renting it from Microplay. At the promenade, actually. Oh. First hit. No, this f face. No one was ever meant to be uh, that asshole. My second hit. <laughs> That's a big hit. Yep. And he'll respawn, won't he? Yeah. Told you. Oh, I knew that. I just wanted to show it. <laughs> Gotta jump through the doors. But this... yeah, X was the first uh, Mega Man game I ever, uh, you know, bought. Yeah, 3 was the first I had and bought. Got it used. You looking for a health? Yeah. Funny they never brought back the enemies in the hallways. And those stupid point pallets do nothing. Yeah. This is what I hated about early NES games. It can just be aggravating. Come on. There we go. Maybe to forget it. Uh, I mean, Cut Man's not exactly hard. Yeah, if I would get anything from this guy. Okay, screw it. Oh, by the way, just so I remember for later. Oh, okay, no. Uh, That's good to know. That is that. I'm trying to remember. Okay, I didn't mean to save data there, but. Matt okay. says, Aw, I made Cut Man the unofficial mascot for my wife's tailor shop. That's cool. Yeah, these hallways were originally to disguise loading times, like, you know, I think on the Famicom disk system, but then I think they went to the cartridges, uh, and it was just kind of a leftover from that. Ah. Uh, yeah, so when we need the select button later, we need to press the uh, right bumper. That's what I was trying to figure out there. Oh, is that for the menu? That's for the, um, like, uh, the pause trick. Oh. Yeah, I'm sure we're laying on that. Cutman's first. Who comes after Cutman? Bombman? Paperman? Um, I mean... Rapman. Whatever you want. Oh, shoot. I forgot those things go that far. Yep. Oh! Oh! You got it. I don't know what that was. That was odd. That was kind of cool, though. What, the way it just kind of paused? It's just like, it looked like you got him, and then it's like, no, he got you. Yeah. That was close. Well, that was not my finest moment, but I haven't played this... <sighs> but I haven't played this in, uh, quite some time, actually. Whenever this came out, uh, originally, in fact. You play Cutman on Mega Man X8, though. Uh, yeah, you can also, like, one-shot him there. Oh, shoot. What, do you use to one-shot him? Doesn't Zero have- is one of Zero's weapons? You can, like, just, like, friggin', uh, blast him with a charge shot. <laughs> He's, like, nothing. <laughs> you, you remember Mega X, the episode of the cartoon, and how uh, X was, like, so OP? Yeah. Yeah, that was, like, literally the video game equivalent. <laughs> It was such an awesome scene. Just such disregard for everything X was is amazing. So to answer your question, Alec Man is the one who's weak to rolling cutter, but I don't know that we won't really uh, want to go through with Alec Man right now. Uh, I'll do. Yeah, do, do do who you want there. Um, we're not really we're not gonna like spam save states or anything, but like you know, say with the uh, tracks and gutsman stage for example, we'll save like right before it just so we're not wasting. Oh, how we got time there, rewind. Back there. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, we got that. I forgot. 
Uh, uh, modern technology. May as well give it a try. Alright, what is a gut? I mean, I know what guts are, but what is a gut? And why is it a man? Do, 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 do you have it? No. Da, da, oh, that was cool. Da, 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 da. Whoop. Whoop. Okay. Uh, let's see, so... Did Mega Man always have, like, a... A lag when he, like, stops, like... Not always, but he did in this one. He's also, like, really heavy. <laughs> I noticed. Alright, I'm gonna do my best. That's why God He's I a robot, the right line. and he is heavy. So, uh, I didn't get to say before, but hey, press the buttons, and welcome to the chat. And thanks for joining us. Welcome, everyone, to the chat. Oop, that's the yeah, welcome, everyone. And, uh, let's see, including first-timer, uh... Gabby... Quail? Sorry, my... I really gotta get new glasses. <laughs> I gotta get mine Asking, filled out. Is this one? And, uh, it yep, is this certainly is the one. This is the one. Whoop. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're gonna need to rewind a little further than that, dear. Uh, I hate this game so much. Yeah, he's really laggy in this, frankly. Top men. <laughs> Top men. That's funny, they call me Bottom Woman. <laughs> Says, uh, <laughs> Gabby Quail. Like man is weak to scissors. Ah. Cutman puts up a decent fight in Mega Man 8 Saturn. Uh, the version Capcom refuses to acknowledge. Yeah, that is so annoying. Yes. That came from uh, Roma Altana. I think it's Atma. Hi, Atma. Oh, okay. At uh, Altana. no. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Did you save after you uh, got across the pit? No, should I? Probably, unless you want to do it again. Uh, what's the save state again? Uh, press the, uh, select button. Oh, so, not, not the act, I mean, the, mm. <laughs> yeah. This one. Yes. Uh. We can change button can... configuration for that if we want, but. No, I'm good. Like I said, as long as I have the rewind, that'll probably take care of a lot of this. Pikman. Yeah. Uh, let's see. I forget if that only goes back so far, though. Let's see, um. Zefbank is SJ E8. Hi, I want Oh, screw off. <laughs> Alright, extra man. And yeah, it's been a while, MCB. Do, do. Hope you're feeling better these days. Indeed. These are hard days. I'm digging out my glasses because Woo. my vision just seems really off today. I'm not even gonna stick around for that. Fun! No sir Bob. Yeah. yeah. And watch that hitbox. That hitbox is a bitch. I know from experience. I can see the TV fine for anybody curious, oh, but like, yeah, looking at this tablet up close, I'm having a little trouble. Welcome to Old Town. Yeah, I gotta get my. I, I got my. I got my eyes examined. I need. Uh, I need. Um, they call it progressive, but I think they mean bifocals. But I gotta bring in my glasses to get those put in. All right, now I remember why I quit wearing these. I feel like it makes it wor yeah, it actually makes it worse. Yeah, you definitely need to get the kind of glasses. I Ugh. We're all getting getting old at the same time. Here's the thing: getting old is expensive. Like, we gotta pay for our Power. lenses. Yeah, as a kid, it's like, oh yeah, when I'm older, I'm gonna have all this money and I'm gonna like you know use it on stuff. And then it's like, yeah, getting older like costs more. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of all a trade-off in the end. I like being older, because I can make my own rules, I can do what I want. But you get old, and you get sore, and depressed a lot of the time, so you just take that with the good. It's, I, it's a trade-off. I still prefer being an adult, frankly. The only thing I really miss is my... Well, I never had, like, a s nice, lithe body, but... Yeah, I miss my physical youth. Yeah. But I don't have to deal with homework or like that, which is nice. And I, I have a job I like, that mostly video games anyway, so... Hi there, Lance. Who says it sure is expensive. Huh. Uh, Gabby says, I tried to make an eye appointment in August, and they were like, we can fit you in, in February. My uh, optometrist saw me pretty quickly, but with COVID, everything kind of gets effy, too. Uh oh, I have a problem. Since when does he do this? <laughs> he's just... Yeah, he's gone aggro. <laughs> I got like a couple extra minutes, so I don't care. But, uh, okay. Um, does the cut blade work on that at all? I'm sure it does. Just how well, well is the is the is the question? 
Uh, let's see. Gabby says these Witcher three menus are rough. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And um, uh, let's try it. Why not? Add my. Okay, actually putting on those glasses for a moment, I feel like my vision cleared up a little after. You, you just kind of need to get used to it sometimes, and you've been, like, with new glasses or glasses you haven't had for a long time. Well, I'm saying, like, taking them off, and now I'm seeing better than I was before I put them on. Oh, you just needed to focus. Yeah, I guess. Oh, yeah, that's interesting. It's no use! Uh, I was told being an adult would be cool, but all I got was this anxiety. Yeah. And I missed my hair. That's it. February for the left eye, April for the right eye, says press the buttons. Wow. Like... You don't see both eyes at the same time? You're talking about, like, eye surgery. Because actually my mom had her cataracts removed recently, and they do one at a time. You do one eye, and then, like, a couple months later, they do the other. I thought it was a joke, but now I'm wondering. I guess you get him down to a certain amount, and he gets aggro on you. Yeah, he's just like, you know what, f*** this, I got a coffee break coming up, and I'm union. As he should be. All robots should be unionized. Yeah. I think there was a story like that in some manga or something or other. I, I really wish it. Iwamoto would, the, the the translation for that would come out. Alright, here you go. Alrighty, let's see. Um, I'm talking about the exam appointment. Okay, woo. Look, man, he's nothing but a maverick. That's what the, the. Yeah, but we got the rolling cutter and we've got the power arm, so why not? Does the power arm help at all against him? I don't. Oh, yeah, there's like a couple of blocks in his room or something, isn't there? There are, but I was thinking more in terms of getting the magnet beam. Oh yeah, and you can the cutter can beat these ass wipes. God, I hate these things. I think one thing that disappointed me about Mega Man 9 was that it just didn't have the graphics that you expect from a game of its caliber. Like, even Mega Man 1 had more backgrounds than it did, and it's like... I don't know, just something that disappointed me. They improved it with 10. I like 10 better than 9, frankly. I said it. I mean it. Yeah, I think uh, I agree there. Uh -oh. God okay. almighty, at least they- Return! Okay. Not this my best moment, but- This is such an R.E.M. song, I can't it. remember the name of it. But yeah, I remember they just kind of looked at it whole so. Remember it's like the mask song. Oh, that's right, that too. Mass Crusaders. But I mean the the uh, what do you call it? The song I'm talking about matches this even more. Ah. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, you always gotta look out for that. This was a good exercise in pattern recognition. I think in some ways. Oh. Sorry. Oh, you do need to fill up. In some ways, video games helped me with like stuff like that because I was never great at it. And my uh, hand-eye coordination was terrible, but it got a little better once I played games. But I couldn't do that. I'm very limited on it. Like, doing Heatman stage, for example, like, that is a total no-go. Oh, that's- no, you gotta use a jet sled for that sh I ain't got no clue, darling. Mega Man 9 went too far back. The lack of- slide severely limit my enjoyment of the game. I agree. Dr. Light could never figure out why the slide mechanism stopped working in modes 9 and 10. Press the button says, Years ago at my office, I put a Windows program on a co-worker's PC that would play the boss chosen intro screen and jingle every time we launched an application using the Windows icon for the Robot Master picture. Oh, crap. That's pretty funny. Um... When I was in high school, someone installed, like, there was some app that would just kind of randomly spit out a Homer Simpsons quote every five minutes, and they put it on all the computers, and it was running on all the computers when we were having a math class in there one one day. I don't know why we were having math in the computer lab, but anyway. Oh, hold on one second. I'll keep playing if that's all right. Yeah. Oh, well, they hung up anyway. Oh, okay. That works. That's what we're saying. Oh yeah, so he's trying to teach us, and every five minutes there's a computer saying mmm burger or something like that. Oh. And he finally lost it. That teacher was not very stable. Huh. Good math teacher though. Probably the only math teacher who actually like I understood for once in my life. Cause I always had trouble with math, but he just Explained it in a way that made perfect sense and never had a guy like him ever again, but he was kinda nuts.
So the way Mega Man Mayhem is going to go is basically we're playing through everything that we can stream. So if it's something that we can like, you know, plug into the computer, then we are playing it. But we're playing them all the way through, not like our usual kind of hopping around stuff. So if we were to finish this today, we'd move right on to Mega Man 2. Or like, you know, if we don't finish this today, then we'll pick it up the next time and uh, then, you know, just kind of go on from there. And uh, we're looking at doing it in like kind of a chronological order based on the, uh, not order of release, but which, I don't know, maybe that would be more interesting. I guess we'll see. But uh, I was thinking like the timeline, like in a story, so like all of classic, then all of X and so forth. Yeah. I forget, are we doing this every other week or? Uh, more or less, not a hard and fast rule, but yeah, I'd like to, since we only uh, stream every other week anyway. Yeah. What the? Oh right, he has that. I forgot he has it on the floor. Oh man, that really takes oh. out of him. Oh! He just stands there contemplating his death a minute before he just explodes in existence. You think you can take him on without a full uh, health bar? I'm I'm actually curious about that. So. It's a nasty little maverick. Yeah, almost got him though. He did, yeah. And uh, there goes the language thing. Noah Blasters wants to know: Are we going to be doing the Game Boy games? Uh, if they, if we end up with a way to, like, you know, be able to stream them, sure. But as far as I know, we don't really have a way, unless your laptop's uh, able to emulate and we can stream from that. I don't think so. Hi, Metcom. Thank you for... He says, Happy Mega Man 35th, and congrats on the new site. Ah, thank you very much. Incidentally, I wouldn't want to do Dr. Wily's Revenge anyway. I never... Did I play it? If I did it, what didn't make much of an impression. Man, that was scary. I don't know who, who died there. Yeah. And we got the... For the biggest asshole out of the way. Yeah, I figured may as well. We... We got the ta tools, we got the talent. Uh, who's that? Uh... That says there are ways. I mean, theoretically, we have a Game Boy Player, and I mean, if we could find a way to get the GameCube, to, but, um... I don't know, that's kind of a bunch of here and there that we don't have the equipment and stuff for now, so... But, um, of course, on the other hand, I don't think we have all the uh, games physically anyway. I don't think we do. Fun fact! I do not own nearly as many Mega Man games as I've played. Same. But like I said, I, was, I also started collecting a little late, so... Yeah, I think, I, like, personally, me, not including what, you know, you brought over, I own uh, Mega Man 1, uh... Mega Man 3. Oh yeah, they don't jump super high in the water here. Yeah, I kind of got effed up there for a sec. <laughs> Mega Man 3... Uh, don't have 4, 5, or 6, or 7. You're talking... Okay, you're talking the console ones. Yeah. I own Mega Man X 1 and 2. I own... Oh, thank God. I mean, I guess if people wanted to kick money at us on, like, you know, Patreon or something to, like, you know, get gear to, like, run Game Boy games or whatever on this thing. Nah, we got plenty to play without that shit. Wee! And there goes our language rating again. Oh, sorry. You said you'd be careful. Sorry! <laughs> I hate this thing. Thank you. I uh, may as well go nuts with it, I suppose. Maybe I can find somebody to, like, you know, edit and sanitize a version for the Mega Man Network YouTube channel. I can well, put the I uncuts mean... on Nightworks with all the rest of our foul-mouthed swagger. Yeah. Oh, he moonwalked. Moon he, moon <laughs> he moonwalked. Iceman That's making right. Poggers face, says Lyra. Yeah! <laughs> okay, I knew it reminded me of something all, these, all this time. <laughs> uh. Nova's Blaster says, it's Miller time, and press the buttons. I love this town! I love the, uh, 
joint reference there. Whoa, 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 woo! Wow, you actually made it. Oh, well, yeah. I'm a total noob. Ah. Mega Man X is a weird one because, like, I own it, I finally bought it, but I bought the Majesco re release. And that had, like, a black and white instruction booklet. And then it just stopped working. We've got, like, I mean, technically we have uh, every X game, um, physically in some form or another. Don't have Super NES X3, though. Ah. We don't? I thought we did. Nope. No, we have it on the PC. I have it on the PC. Yeah, you've got the PC one. We've got, like, you know, we've got the ones in the various collections. The, uh, old Mega Man X collection ah. and, uh, of course, Legacy collection, but... I hate this. You do this. Okay. Oh, do we have the magnet beam? God damn it. For f sake, why didn't you say something? I thought you were trying to, like, I don't know, prove something. No, I have nothing to prove. <laughs> Speaking of the magnet beam. Uh, let's see. Rona says, I my four pog. And uh, Nova Blaster says, Ugh, those block puzzles. The one thing in all of Mega Man that I detest. Right. Oh, here's something to detest even more. This Mavericks. Oh, yeah, these things are like... From my understanding, these things are like completely random. Yeah, they sure move like them. R.I.P. any speedrunners. I wonder if it's actual, actual true random, or like, you know, if there's like some weird mimic thing. Ah! Oh, well. It is, like, I forget how you're supposed to do that. Did you want to rewind for it? Nah, it's alright. And, uh, Rona says they're completely random. Yeah. Which is wild, because I thought, like, you know, complete randomness in a computer program was supposed to be an impossibility or something, but I don't know. I'm not good at that stuff. Neither am I. Was well, those big eyes, because it's like... The way they jump, like, sometimes it's high enough for you to go under, and other times it's left you, so... Yeah. I believe a Lek Beam works on him. That's why I'm here. Well, you don't have it equipped, that's why I wanted to let you know. After the Magnet Beam fiasco. I'm not that stupid. Just a little stupid. Eat electricity. Remember when Robot Master weapons were really damn effective against the Robot Masters they were weak or, you know, strong against? I don't know, with this game, like, it's pretty easy to beat everyone with an arm cannon except for, uh, Electman. Yeah, it kind of makes it kind of, uh, badass. Uh, let's see, um... Supposedly big eyes try to jump to your height, so you can force a big jump by jumping yourself. But that oh. never works out for me. So, yeah, that's uh, interesting. Um... Who do you want, Bomb Man or uh, Fireman? I prefer uh, Bomb Man. I like his music. Okay. So, the way this is set up is funny. Like, it's like a clockwise rotation. So, um, yeah, I press right from Iceman to get here. I press right from uh, Bomb Man to get to Fireman. I just pressed left to get back to Bomb Man. <laughs> ah, talk about like a wild west of ideas. <laughs> Old Blue, hey y'all! Hello. And a couple of times against the master that wielded them. This music, I just realized, is kind of similar to Bright Man's music in 4. 4 had that same kind of introduction. Uh, Bright Man, I mean. In 4. That was a great soundtrack. I wonder how it turned out so... First of all, it was kind of, like, all f***ed up because the uh, Mega Buster took a, uh, a sound channel. But despite that, it was just such a great soundtrack. I mean, Dustman's theme is one of the best of all time. Dustman deserves better. You know, I've gone in and done Fireman Buster only before, like, just at the start of the game. Oh, crap. Oh, Oblu, thank you for pre-ordering the, uh, yeah, the Mega Man fanzine, Mechanical Heart. Which I think is just, pre-orders just went live, actually, so... Uh, now's a good time to grab it if you want. There's a link on my Twitter and all that. 
But, uh, yeah, I have a, a story in there. And you should pre-order the mag and read the mag, because got my story in there, got a few stories in there. Got, uh, great art. Like, pretty incredible. Oh. Oh. I am just... You're not gonna use the chill Something ice slasher on that? Nah. Is the, uh, chinkies that, uh, threw me off there. Those hitboxes are a bitch. Doggone it! It's funny, this is actually, you think about it, you think, oh, Mega Man X started stage manipulation with, like, you know, weapons and, and boss order and all that, but no, it started with this. Because you can freeze those things, too, as I recall. Hey, we have bullet bills, too. And they're worse we than Mario. We have bullet bills at home. Bullet bills at home. Basically. Mario got off easy with the bullet bills. Yeah, he can step on them. Yep. It's like you gotta... Oh, shoot. Got ammunition chasing your ass? Just jump on it. Why did I even... Oh, you thought that was a health power, okay. For a moment, yeah, I was like just... <laughs> I shouldn't laugh. You might want to rewind. Yeah. <laughs> I want to at least get us through the doors. Yeah. I know I said we weren't going to spam save states, but does anybody really want us to redo all that? I sure don't. There I'm we go. Oh, then my time is precious. Oh, a real creative, Wiley. Try to build up some energy here. I don't think you're going to have very much success because got to drop those power up pellets. God, God help you if you don't get the points. I mean, later you don't get anything, so... There's a group working on Mega Man The Sequel Wars in mostly Wily War style. Yeah, we've been kind of keeping an eye on that. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm eager for that. I, it'd be even better if they release it, like, on a cartridge. I don't know if that's, uh... I don't know if they're punching above what the Genesis can do with that, like, you know, technically, but... Yeah. Like, you know, if they could actually, like release that on a cartridge, I think I would buy that. Yeah, that's pretty damn neat. I'd love to see Mega Man X Corruption get finished. Hell, I'd love to see Capcom say, let's adopt it and make it into an official release, but... Yeah. That'll never happen. It just looks so neat. Like, I don't know if it's good or not. It just... It's been working out forever. It just looks like a really cool Mega Man X Metroidvania. Oh my god, why are you doing this to us? If you die, you die. Uh, yeah, I suppose you're right. May as well get it over with. If at he least dies, now I might last dies. more than, like, you know, one shot. After this boss, though, we should probably uh, save. Just so we have a point of reference. Oh! He explode. Yeah, we should be doing that anyway. Oh man, they put you right in the line of fire! Dicks. Indeed. Yeah. Oh, for crying out loud. It's funny I realize now how rare those are. The big pellets. <laughs> oh shoot, I forgot that. You can just hit. Yeah, the other reason we might, like, be using, like, the rewind or save states on occasion is, like, you know, just... They don't refill your weapon energy, so... Yeah. Probably better just power through this. Otherwise you'll lose the war of attrition. Da -da 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 -da. That said, you could probably uh, put it on a cartridge and give it away. Oh, I'd take it. Fortunately, fan game creators are probably lucky Capcom isn't nearly as litigious as their other properties. Yeah. Yeah, I don't Nintendo think Capcom is. gives much of a damn. Uh, they're smart. Yeah, they're, they're more Sega than Nintendo. Although Sega's had their moments, but Sega, anyway. Sega, yeah, they did that, that 
they did in that, um, what do you call it, uh, Shining Force, was it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, that wasn't good. I think a Streets of Rage thing. I don't know, when it comes to Sonic, they're pretty chill, though. Yeah, weird that. I wonder if there's a whole other just set of rules. You don't know what the rules are, even to this day. Maybe they run it by the, like, you know, guys in charge of the franchises. And some are just, I don't know. Anyway, Lent says, I'll be honest, I hate Fireman's uh, stage music on NES. It's so much better than Wily's Revenge. And uh, Altana says, agreed, Lance. I don't remember it on the uh, Dungeons says very well. So you don't remember it where very well? On Gen on Genesis. Uh, it was pretty good there, but I think he's talking about the uh, Game Boy one. Oh, okay. No, I certainly don't remember it. Uh, yeah. I thought I was ahead of the curve on that one. I was like, Bomb Man's stage. Bomb Man's another one I could take out first. Yeah, Bomb Man's usually, I think, who I started with. That's, uh, Gutsman is weak, right? Uh, Mega Man Gutsman's Y. weak to Bomb Man, yeah. Unless you're asking if Bomb Man's weak to Gutsman. No. When I was a kid, I'd wonder about those, like, you know, gaps on the, uh, right side of the screen, and it's like, oh, only Mega Man can, like, get through there. Come Mega Man 3, Mega Man could get through there, but, of course, that doesn't do you any good now, so... Nope. I wonder if they just noticed that part of their design. They're like, hey, what if? Sniper Joe. Oh, right, I used to start with Bomb Man because Nintendo Power featured his stage first, says uh, Altana. I remember that. I think that might have been why I tried it. That makes sense. But really, I think Cut Man's easiest. Game Boy games are surprisingly polished, says Gnomes Blasters. I think my favorite classic series game is still Mega Man 4 for Game Boy. Oh, that was a really good one. That was a good one, yeah. O only one better might be 5, and I mean, that's kind of a tough call, because, like, you know... One has, like, the remixed content, but, like, does it so well that it, like, you know, almost might as well not even be remixed content, and the other is, like, you know, just all new. I remember I took, uh... Mega Man 4 on Game Boy into a college class once because our True Maverick. prof was like, it was snowing like a bitch out there, and of course he could be late to class, but we couldn't, or he <laughs> could not show up, but we couldn't. So we're all of just kind of waiting for him because we fear him because we're all idiots, I suppose. And uh, some kids like, hey, can I borrow your Game Boy and play it? I said, sure, why not? So he takes it and he runs up to the front of the auditorium with it, and I'm like, whatever. And then, like, ten minutes later, I hear him say, Yeah, Gutsman is no more! Or something like that. I can't remember which Robot Master it was. <laughs> Darn! Um... Let's see, Dan Maku says they decided to let it slide. Old Blue says, Kind of like how uh, the Sonic 3 manual referred to glitches as Robotnik's nefarious traps. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> that was pretty clever. In a terrible way. Yeah. Nova's Blaster says, Still mourning Mega Man Mania. Oh, yeah, for sure. Lance says, well, except Mega Man 2. That music was a choice. Rona says, 3, 4, and 5 are all at least on par with the NES games. Agreed. Why'd that come Also, back? I think the Game Boy games just get better as they go. That's weird. I, I think w Wily's Revenge is the worst. 5 is probably the best. And, like, you know, it's just... It's, like, on a scale from there. So I can't get back up there. Weird. I don't know why it came back. That was weird. Hmm. That is weird. Oh, well. Uh, let's see... Mega Man 4 for Game Boy, was that the first classic series game I owned? It might have been. Because, like, they didn't have five at the store at the time. That one would become rare, but I'd get that later. Uh, for ten bucks, like, you know, at a, uh, at, like, uh, Anime North, no less. Uh, cards only, just for the record, but, um, yeah, it's like, you know, I had a super oh. game. <laughs> wow. That's mean. Uh, I, I had a Super Game Boy, and, uh, you know, I wanted something for it, so I went for that one. Uh, they didn't have five. And uh, I was quite pleased with my purchase. Oop. <laughs> that was so stupid. I'm not going to dignify that with anything. Who's they Bomb Man week two? Fireman. Light the fuse, light the fuse, light the fuse. It's Wednesday night. You know what that means? Wait, no, it's not Wednesday. There we go. Bomb Man is no more.
Mega Man Dynamite. I wonder if they're gonna keep that theme uh, after January. Oh, look at this asshole. Where'd he come from? I, I mean, yeah, so it starts me on cut, man, and I have to press... I mean, I guess I could press left from there, but... Stuff's wild, like I said. Oh, yeah, good idea. Dr. Wiley. I remember once reading a fanfic back in the 90s where someone, like, kind of described Wiley doing the quote-unquote eyebrows thing for no reason. Yeah. Where do you even get a UFO? If you can invent a UFO, you don't need to, like, fuck around with robots. I mean, I don't know, they got hover cars and crap, so I mean, it's probably pretty pedestrian, all things considered. Oh. I thought it was interesting how different it looks versus the, uh, like, ones you'd use later. I like his shrubbery. shrubbery yeah, I always thought that was a neat, uh... Shrubbery and cinder here. blocks. Woo! Oh! Jerk! Hooray for hitboxes. Out of my way. I just thought it was interesting that made like a damage sound effect. Yeah, you can't exactly shoot those to death, can you? Oh! Curse that slipperiness. Yeah, that is, uh, so that is not the original game, is it? The original game? Yeah. The slipperiness? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mega Man. Mega Man controls, compared to, like, later games, he does not control very slick here. Yeah, I think that was my main complaint when I played this game for the first time. Like, I put it in, like, oh, okay, original Mega Man, I haven't played this, I'll give this a try, and I realized, wow, this is really clunky. Oh. Yeah, I think that's part of what, like, you know, kind of turned me off before I gave Mega Man 2 a try. Good thing I did, that kind of changed my life forever. Yeah. You have to use the magnet, I guess. I like how you can at least, like, you know, use different, uh, weapon... Okay, that's weird. Uh, wouldn't let me switch. Oh, can you do that on the fly here? What the hell? I didn't know you could do that. You didn't? No. Oh, Lackman really is OP. Yeah, usually I'd save uh, Gutsman for last uh, because of the rail thing and just like go through a like man twice. Hmm. All that for a uh, power up. The things we did. Ugh, and these things come back. Jumpy, jumpy, jumpy. I was gonna say, yeah, maybe, uh. There's just something so classic about this, uh, an NES bomb explosion sound. Thunder Bleam is the real most OP weapon in the series. It sure is. Hi, Sheep. Sheep. Thanks for coming. I like your name. Sheep. That reminds I like me. how I said we're not gonna like you know abuse safe states rewinds and what do I freaking do? Oh, I was all I was all set to abuse safe states and rewinds. Well, I don't want to like overdo it. Let's just put it that way. Like, look at this. Mavericks. These guys are running you right up into the spikes too. Yeah, I just saw that. Come here, we are normal enemies. Come on down. Yeah. Now they're just causing havoc. Did they just get caught in a... I think so. Hooray, NES algorithms. Nope. <laughs> this. That's the way we do it. This is how we do it. Stupid asshole had to get the last word in. Yeah, really? <laughs> this was tricky. I remember having trouble with this as a kid. Ah, uh, crap. Uh, 
Ah! Yeah, there you are. Took up way more magnet beam. Ah, ah, crap! Rewind me a bit. Yeah, I'm only doing that because, like, you know, getting low on power there. Yeah. And what do you do if you run out? Uh... Die. I think you can go back down and uh, the energies respawn, but that's pretty uh, time-consuming. Oh, yeah, and yeah. And since we're only running for, like, 90 mi uh, minutes... Uh-oh. No! I didn't realize I was here yet. All right, let's see uh, you do this, Mr. No-Pause no Spam Trick. One two punch that gets me. Yeah. Crap, I should not have done that. Did you want to take a turn? Hell no. How are we doing on lives? Okay, that ain't good. I thought we had more lives. If I were you, I'd save. Yeah. If I were me, I would save too. At least it puts you right here. Yeah. See, if it was a better controlling Mega Man, I might stand a better chance. And if I had the slide move, that one uh, bit would probably be no problem. That's the only reason I could do it in Mega Man 3. Ah, crap. Double crap. Well, that news just generally a little easier there too. I got it. Yeah, it moved slower. And he had that like kind of whole shuffle thing too that was a little easier to dodge. Yeah. Crap, crap, crap. Oh, why do I keep jumping into it? Yeah, just dodging that one two, as you say, that one two punch. Like, how are you supposed to do that? You know what? It's just faster this way. <laughs> Servbot 20, hello! Hey, 20! How are you? I think I've done this like once in my life. Oh, you did it there. Ah, but then you missed Ugh. the fucking shot. Oh, I hate this boss with all my heart. Problem is, to hit him, you have to jump right into his path of his weapon. Yeah. Okay, so, uh... Pulling the chat... Should I keep trying this, or should we just, like, um... Uh, I overrule everyone. Trick. We pause trick. Besides, there's some youngsters who might not have seen how it works. Okay, fair enough. I remember playing, uh, just the devil, uh, it was so incredible to see in Mega Man X5. And hearing the music. That was kind of sweet. Yeah. Ah. Crap. Just I'm not it. used to having that on the shoulder. Oh, you'll get it next time. <laughs> Is that even hitting him? There you go. Oh no! He's dead. We did it. We did it. We're warriors. First time chat. Uh, Sep, am I pronouncing that right? Says pause for sure. Lance says sure. Do the trick. We're here to have fun. And <laughs> Lyra, whoa, neat. Yeah, see, isn't that cool? <laughs> you yellow devil. And it uh, works on pretty much any weapon. Uh, are you doing this one or am I? 
Uh, I guess I'll go and give it a try. Um, should we save? I guess we should. Yes, absolutely. We have, like, no lives. We have no energy either. What the? Yeah, that's an old school Mega Man thing. Uh, you were stuck with the energy you had through the Wily levels. Well, you don't really need it as much now, do you? I can't remember how to beat, uh... Need what? Like, the energy for weapons. Whoop. I mean... It's- they're handy. Darn! Okay, you know what? Please. Yeah, I think we've broken almost every rule we've set out for ourselves on this. <laughs> I don't let myself get frustrated with games. I no, just that's don't. fair enough, but it's just, you know, it's like anybody can spam through. I mean, we're Good. pretty professionals, damn it. I'm a professional? Never said I was professional. Okay, I'm a professional, damn it. Oh, sh this. Sh um, if we die and continue, where do we continue from? Uh, the same stage. Might be a good idea, just kind of, you know, start it fresh. I, uh, I guess give it a try. Yeah, see, we're good. Does it refill your uh, weapon energy? Okay, yeah. Yeah, so we made the right choice. I was gonna say you should probably save them. I got a point. You should probably save then. I'm trying, but these little mavericks. Well, you know what? Yeah, I definitely gotta see if I can find somebody who can uh, bleep some stuff out. There we go. I'm sorry. No, you're not. No, I'm not, but I can't help it. So, uh, Lance says, Powered Up made this incredibly difficult in classic mode. I'm trying to remember that. Like, I don't remember it being too bad, but I could be misremembering. Yeah, same. Uh, Sheep uh, says, Take that optimal death. Who's and, uh. Batman Week against again? Oh, uh, yeah, you're not gonna like this. Guts, man. Oh, well, that does mean a lot of f***ing good, doesn't it? Oop. I think Fireman might have some effect on him. Yeah, just... Get yeah, really. Weak ass with a buster. Doesn't deserve any sort of dignified death. Oh, he heard me. <laughs> there. Uh, let's see. Press the button says, love that game over, uh, tune. Oh, game over to Yeah. Uh, the cops are coming for Mega Man, says Lyra. I hear them. <laughs> yeah, that was the cops, all right. Press the button, says fire, too. Post trick didn't work and powered up. Yeah, but I don't think it needed it as much. Yeah, I think it was a little more... Do I need anything? I'm pretty good. Like, if I remember, the physics weren't, like, you know, this, like, hey, let's make Mega Man extra slippery and extra heavy, like, you know, malarkey. Ah, uh, piss on the... Mavericks! Um, shoot. What was it? Uh, ice? Uh, no, it's cut. Is it cut? Oh, that was ice. For Elecman? Yeah. I used, uh, Elec on Iceman, not the other way around. Oh, shit, that went a lot easier than last time. Yeah, because, like... There's no, uh, room. terrain, yeah. Yeah. Goodbye. The only game that... Oh, shit. Uh, the only game that did the, uh what we're doing now with the robot masters, like, fighting them as, you, as they come instead of, like, really, going into a uh, tube, a series of tubes. Like, only Mega Man X did that again, and I always preferred it, frankly. Yeah, me too. I think they uh, improved it in Maverick Hunter X, if I recall correctly, because, yeah. uh, I think, like, you know, okay, it was Sigma Stage, what was it, 3, I think? That, like, you know, it's like, okay, we're just dumping the rest here, like, you know, in a friggin' gauntlet. Which was still, like, you know, preferable, but, like, I think they spread them out more in, uh, in Maverick Hunter X. I remember just remember the music for the third stage of Sigma. That was so great. Scarab says, cut the cord. Man, I'm so mad we never got Maverick Hunter 2. I'm so mad I don't get Mavic Hunter more. Here for a second. Period. Oh, yeah, I was just thinking the, even the bomb might work. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, is this the crazy Mega Man stage? Oh, copy robot? Yeah. Yeah.
Well, I mean, it sort of worked, but not in the way I really intended to. Well, bye! There's a reference there for the Avatar fans. Boomerang's not coming back. <laughs> Everyone gets electrified in the end. They give you a lot of power for that elect beam too, compared to like, you know, what later games would probably do. Oops, turn it on now. Can I drop a bomb from here? Whoa, that did not work. <laughs> not a single thing about that works the way it's supposed to. Oh, no! that's even worse. Bye. Beaks. Are they really called Beaks? Uh, I think the U.S. manual did. I forget what their Japanese name is. I miss when, like, you know, they'd uh, actually name the enemies, like, you know, here, and then it's like they just stopped in Japan. They all had names, but going back and trying to learn all of them, like, you know, at this stage is just kind of... I remember some and not others. That was weird. There it says yeet. Whoop. And Lance says powered up uh, also could have become a thing. It's amazing that Mega Man did Mario Maker first. Yeah. Almost did it first twice if you count Mega Man Universe. I don't. Well, good. I mean. Okay, sure. Well, it never came out. I don't think that. It didn't come out. I'm saying if it came out. Uh, I don't think they had a clear plan for that. Maverick! Cool, it, disco. It would have uh, done it before Mario Maker. Burn, baby, burn. How do I beat this guy? I don't Mega Man powered up in Maverick Hunter X should have been PS2 releases. That was cool. Alongside the uh, PSP. If you could call him Mega Man this whole time. Oh. So I think he's here. <laughs> there it says, copy robot disco party zone. Absolutely. Oop. Do you remember what to do to beat this maverick? Bathroom tiled, man. Yeah. Uh, to be honest, not precisely. There's a bunch of ways you can go about it. I was gonna use the Buster this time. I just remember uh, top spin for the Mega Man Three ones for some reason. Oh, John! what am I doing? <laughs> Take that. Rewind. Or don't. This is like Alucard. What was it with this era and clones? Hey, cool. I got an idea for not having to spend a sp new, make a new sprite set. Holy <gasps> sh! You've done it again, you wild genius. As always, the elect coil is treasonous. Wow, this guy has nothing in the way of iframes. That's probably the only thing saving my ass right now. Yeah, that's uh, one good thing about the. Uh... Okay, you know what? I had you two mixed up. Um, there's one good thing about the, um, this first game. The first two or three games, actually, is like, yeah, they didn't have this whole, like, uh, recovery time thing. Lance Hart says the, think, uh, and he's right about this, the people who played it, I think, at TGS or GDC, I can't remember, they didn't like it. Apparently it just felt aimless. What's that? Universe? Yeah, Oh, universe. yeah, yeah. But, I mean, you know, I'm saying, you know, as far as making stuff, but as for whatever they already had... Oh, is this, uh, are we at Wily? No, not yet. Oh, right, now's the, um... Darn! Can't remember who's next. Uh, I forget the designation, but the nickname was Bubble Boy. <laughs> wow, that's a 90s name if I ever heard one. Remember when the media was focused on things like this boy lives in a bubble and everyone was like, Wow, this is worldwide news, and now it's like, The president's committed treason. Oh, it's Friday, is it? Sure. Yeah, it's a hard dodge. Pretty it's the easy water stage boss. On the hold. Says Lance Hart. Bubble machine, Scarab says. Wee! Yeah, it has some code number as well. That's the part that always. The ancestor of Bubble Man. Woohoo! Come on, life energy. I know the uh, penguins are called Peng. Oh, isn't it after the Evangelion character, I wonder? No, this had to have come before Evangelion. 
Yeah, this was definitely before Evangelion. So Peng comes from Mega Man. There we go. I see what you're up to in Evangelion. If anybody's wondering where Zinni comes from, I've got an article about that on uh, the Mega Man Network. Is that a fan pushing you along? Like, I don't understand what's going on there. It's water current. Ah, mother. Oh, check it out. Guts Man is suddenly useful again. Take that, Bubble Boy. Oh, I think I... You know what? I screwed this up. I just remembered. Whoop. What did you screw up? Save the uh, guts uh, blocks for the later ones, because they... Uh... Oh, they get faster. Yeah. Although I might have uh, switched too soon. Yeah. Well, that's alright. You got a good head start on them. No, no! Would Cutsman's uh, thing work on them? Maybe. Dang! Oh, that kid's fast. Oh! <sighs> Why, Lord? I forget what else was. Maybe I'll try a luck. Uh, I was gonna say, a, a luck beam just massacres everything, so why not give that a try? Yeah. Oh no, the blocks are gone. Oh sh I forgot about that. Are you gonna be able to rewind that far, though? We'll find out. I think you might have a problem. If not, then maybe I'll, uh. Reload. Wee! Yeah, I don't think I can rewind that far. Might be worth a try. See, like, you got one, you know, hit left, see what you can do with it. Oh, if only we could rewind oh, like, our try it here? Yeah, yeah. I think that was an encouraging sound? It's hard to tell. Oh no, there's one more. Come on, Elect Beam! Ah, oh, Elect Beam, you failed us all! Shoot! Elect Beam, you're not cool anymore. You go into the dungeon. I think I definitely can't rewind far enough now. Yeah. Is, is it Elect that he's weak to? That's what uh, Press Buds is saying, but I think obviously Guts is the most. Uh, most important. Okay, you know what? Why? Are you sure? Yeah. Honestly, at this point, it's probably easier to just uh, redo the stage. It's not very. No, yeah, anyway. not that there's much there, I guess. Woo! You sure love throwing those. Effing batteries at you. I remember seeing the Mega Man X4 and how cool it was that they were, like, walking. That was neat. Seeing X4 for the first time was just so neat. Ooh. No! Ah, shoot. Oh, well. You did your best. Hardly, but... Eh, I'll roll with it. With any luck, you'll get... Wee! Okay, there was the current. Sorry, I missed it the first time. Good thing Mega Man can breathe underwater for now. See, there you go. Wee. I was hoping to grab some weapon energy along the way, but how very hypnotic! I can't uh, pause like while the uh, projectiles are on screen. Oh, I didn't know that actually. Well, I can't pull up the sub screen. Right yeah, now. that's what I mean. Yeah, that's pretty interesting. I didn't know that. Yeah, I had forgotten that. Nice of them just kind of push you along. The guy's about to hit you. Nope, just barely missed. Alright, let's do this again. Oh no! Did you just switch to the wrong thing? No, I accidentally destroyed uh, one of my... Uh... Oh right, shit. A luck beam. 
have to be careful about that later. Dug on it! I was not facing that way! Did he knock me that way or what? Yeah. Ah, jerk. Yeah, I guess it's a safer bet. Let's see if you can do this, I guess. To find out. Woo! Woo! Okay, you almost got that one, at least. Wow, that just, uh... I guess explosions were kind of a thing they added in later Mega Man games. <laughs> yeah, I think so. You don't have a budget for that. Um, oh wow, lucky you. Why am I doing Mega Man? Uh, sorry, am I doing Wily? Uh, I believe so. I'd probably die anyway. Should probably save. Good point. Oop, I forgot it does that. I love how he does this, like, weird, like, scrunchy thing, like, when he's, like, transitioning like that. Yeah. Uh, okay, so let's see. Rock is done with your shit. Clone Sun, Water Boss, Bubble Machine. Love you guys. Ah, we love you too. Thank Aww. you, uh, Gal Galileo Potato. Galileo Figaro. Classic Seinfeld 2. Aryan God's on your side for that one up, says Lance. Yeah. Evil was mid 90s, says Lyra. Wonder if Netflix oh. is really going to make live action, says Matcom28. Oh dear. Or is it 28 or 26? No, that's a 26, my bad. Uh, press the buttons. Oh, look! And yeah, you reverse direction when you take damage. Man, that is... That was a choice. I always... Seeing those Gutsmans the first time... Uh, Gutsmen? It kind of freaked me out. I love the idea that Wily was basically manufacturing an army here. Yeah, I guess that's the implication, huh? Pretty much. And uh, press the button says P for the first three, then G, then finish off with E. Uh, didn't quite go that way, but... Close enough. Thanks, though. We got her done. Oh, no. Why didn't you read that to me? I don't wanna. Uh, John! we got these things now again, don't we? But yeah, then again, but... we also got the Magnum Beam. I was just gonna say, I don't think they're as bad here. Magic moments. Uh, wait, before you go in, hit, hit uh, pause real quick. Yeah, we should probably go for that, eh? Yeah, I would. Place to save. Indeed. Remember to save again after you get it. Yep. And an extra life, too. And it says, nah, he's using Gutsman to hold up his castle. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I, I thought that was... I kind of like the idea that, like, you know, these uh, robots are how he's able to make these uh, castles so quickly. Yeah, it's not a bad... Uh... I think Melgrim uh, went with that in, uh, like, Robot Wars. Oh, did he? I believe so. That makes sense. He had good fanfics. Oh, yeah. Um, what? Oh, right. Sorry about that. I was, like, watching and I was like, what? What? What are you doing? <laughs> Why would you? There we go. Yeah. I was going to tell you to save if uh, you took another step. Scarab says, later he just used Concrete Man. Yeah, probably, like in conjunction or something. I forgot this was a cut. Fire. There's a little more of a logic to, like, you know, who's weak to what here. Yeah, it kicked my ass. And they don't give you the uh, power-up anymore. They used to give you the power-up, or they, in the newer games, they yeah. give you the power-ups. Welcome to NES Hard! NES, my ass. Welcome to Get the G Game Genies when I like it. Darn! Yeah, you wanna take over? Oh, okie doke. I'm bad at Mega Man. There's my secret captain. Logic only starts going out the window by Mega Man 3. Oh, are we starting here? I guess so. 
Well, when Mega Man 3 gives you things like hard man, what are you supposed to do? I remember my mom laughing at hard man. I had no idea what she was laughing at. I was too young. Uh, who was the next one? Fire. I was looking at, there was a clip I saw of, like, uh, Beavis by Head where Beavis had that open wound. Mm hmm I don't think I've ever seen that one. But, like, the thought he had rabies. Oh, uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, classic comedy. Wow. Ooh. Sure settled his hash. That, uh, pause threw me off my took a hit. That was cheap. Hard Man is second only to Thrust Man. I'm surprised we haven't had a Thrust Man yet. Like, that honestly surprises me. Take your time exploding, Bomb. It's not like we, uh... Not like we're on a time. Okay, that was some nonsense. Especially since I was jumping when, uh... He hit the ground. Yeah, Dara works, like, when you try to, you know. <sighs> if you die, will you? Start me? Yeah, I was gonna say, to start you a Cutman or start you a Gutsman? Well, Cutman's not even here. Sorry. We're going back to the future. Like, I want to do this, except, like, you know, for the, uh... Part where, like, you know, we don't have a uh, weapon energy anymore. Well, Blue says, and then Kojima ripped him off with, like, Die Hard Man. Yep. Okay, uh, Paul time. Should I, like, pause trick this bastard? Yeah, just pause trick him. We're getting down to the end of the day here. Does pause trick work on him? Pause trick works on everything. No, you don't say. I put that on everything. <laughs> I understood that reference. Is it the luck beam they gotta use or the bomb? Oh, uh, did that work? Might have been too late. Oh, yeah. At least I think it works with the bombs. It works with most weapons here. There you go. Wow, this bomb is one slow mother effer. We got him. Whew. Ladies and gentlemen. I barely have any energy left. Well, at least hopefully you'll, uh... Was that all four? I think so. Oh, sorry. No, wait. Yeah, he would put, uh... Gutsman last. That was a pretty intimidating goal. Okay, I, I was stopping before I went in, and Mega Man just slid through anyway. My UFO is pregnant. Did it start you here? Yeah, thankfully. Okay, good place to save. Yeah, I just didn't do it before, because... Why? <laughs> Hey, remember when all of Mega Man's weapons could fit on a single menu? Yeah. Although I guess, like, in X, like, you know, they could too, but... I think it was Fireman for the first phase. I think so. That works as well either. Was it the Elect Beam? I think so. It's always the Elect Beam. Bless you. I don't know, it, doesn't, it could be bringing him down more, but I don't know. If I wanted to, like, you know, do the uh, cheesy way, but. Oh, uh, let's see. Was it um, ice? Yeah, I know. 
You know, it's weird. I could have sworn it was bombs. How are it supposed to be bombs that they can't even hit them? I thought, I thought like it, like, hit the thing. Maybe I'm thinking the first phase. Yeah, the first phase is pretty open. Oh, Cutsman works pretty well. I guess this is why they give you the energy pellet outside the door. Yeah. The Elect like Beam, you can, like, do the pause trick and uh, get them to. I feel like such a cheat, though. <laughs> What was the one in the Eagle Raptor animation? Cookman? I don't even remember that. <laughs> it sounds like something that would be there. I just remember Honus Wagner card, man. Honus Wagner card, man. That was from, uh, like. Dr. Wiley goes broke? Yeah. Well, the. It was like some comedy trip or something, like Rich Old White or something. It was pretty funny. <laughs> Raptor's a egg, man. All right. Oh, I thought you got him. No, he he had a lot more life than I did there. Oh, what a bastard. Oh, you almost got him. Do you want to take a turn? Yeah, sure. Um, it's a fire. Oh, man, he delivers a beating. <laughs> it resets enemy uh, hit and vulnerability, but not hitboxes on weapons, so it works with anything. But it's easiest with a big projectile like Lek Beam, says Dan Maku. Radioactive man. Oh, wait, Simpsons did it. That's just junk, man. Bad frames on it. Those bullets basically being invisible is annoying, says Lance. Yeah. yeah. I think we've tried almost everything, haven't we? Have we tried ice? No, but... It's not doing much. I do like the sound when you rewind, just the do 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 do. Yeah, for sure. But yeah, it's hard to see. Is like the flicker is uh, annoying. Okay, I'll try one more time. Yep, yep. Maybe cut. You know, maybe I think I see people just use the P cannon against a second. Uh, Oh gosh, phase. you might be right. Because of this exact Dr. Wowie. It's hard to really blah 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 dramatic music, dramatic music, dramatic music, dramatic oh, music. Cat Tango. Our cat Tingo is uh, decided to take up residence on the sofa on top of it behind us. Indeed. Oopsie. There would be something symbolic about using the uh, Mega Buster. Not the kind of symbolism they go for anymore, but yeah. You want to give it a try? Yeah. Looks like we're going to finish right in time. Yeah. Or with any luck with a few minutes to spare. Sure, Bot 20 says Tango. Indeed. Yeah, the cutter gets more uh, hits. Uh, as uh, Lance, but I feel like the you can just bust it. it's easy to bust, easier to bust it because it keeps you out of trouble. You don't have to get as close. Yeah, too bad the fire is not doing as much there. But you do have to jump really high, so I can only get one shot off at a time. But you can also spend that time. Avoiding that projectile. Ooh, trying. I'm not doing a very good job at it. I got it. I've noticed it sometimes goes over your head and sometimes it goes like right for you. And I wonder if it has to do with the way you jump the way it does with like, the big eye. Yeah, I'm thinking the same thing. If y'all just like get sick of this guy, just like let me know and I'll. Uh... Well, like I said, we're almost at the end, so if we can't do it, we'll just. Yeah. 
Oh, he might be on the right track here. Huh. Oh, you bitch. There. Now Woo! I'm gonna apologize. I'm sorry. I suck. I promise I won't do it again. There's one thing I learned from Mega Man, it's how to adapt. Rare. I am elite. The elite. The the elite. <laughs> Surfbot20 says, saving the world. Now for one of my favorite endings in the series. Mega Man ended the evil domination of Dr. Wily and restored the world to peace. Domination. I knew that you were going to go there. I just love the weirdly suggestive language these localizations had in the time, like... I don't think this was even a localization. I think they changed Rock to Mega and that was it. If I remember right. No, you might be right, but e even so, that's the case, like, saying, like, Simon Belmont has consummated his encounter with Dracula? Like, come <laughs> on! <laughs> Press the button says, yay achievements. Hell yeah, yay achievements. For some reason, I thought that- no, I'm thinking 4 is the one where it kind of echoes this one, which is riding on a train. It is. Being pissed off about how they didn't, like, reveal anything. It was just a- It was not until, uh, Mega Man 4 that I saw Rock for the first time. As Rock, not Mega Man. Yeah. Because, like, yeah, you didn't get to see anything here. Help, there's flicker in my hair. It's worse than headlights. Heh. <laughs> HMD, huh. I forgot who that was. That was a beautiful Joe guy. I think so. Or maybe it was paying like homage to the same guy, but yeah, I believe that's what the HMD on his uh, shirt stands for. I actually have one of those shirts. <laughs> there it says, Little BB Astro Boy Rock. Yeah. Lance says, By the way, if you play the X series, please play it on SNES for your sanity. Uh, why? Because, <laughs> like, we can't really. I mean... We can load up the, uh... We can get the Super NES Classic, but yeah. that's only good for one game. Yeah, we can play Mega Man X that day. But, um, yeah, why? Um... I like how the city suddenly ends. <laughs> Capcom USA, comma, says Scarab. Capcom <laughs> yeah, USA. And Finish says, thought, I think please. I remember Nintendo Power theorizing HMB was his master's dance. <laughs> that's pretty funny, actually. Now you can do it again. If you hate yourself. And I don't hate myself. All right, so we got a few minutes. Uh, let's say we start Mega Man 2. All right. Are we going to, like, just pick up from there when we resume, or...? Yeah. Okay. That's the power of safe states. Then again, at this point, it's probably just time enough to get to the intro and stuff. Oh, uh, yeah, maybe one stage. So are we playing it on normal, or are we playing it on uh, baby mode? Yeah, baby mode. That's what I know. Okay. Do They're normal and like about. I, lo I love the like way they kind of have the same like ending theme here as yeah to start the game. I don't think I reali realized that for years. Lance says I've yet to get the upgrade Buster from Flame Mammoth stage due to the input lag. The X collection uh, on PS4 and PC have done me wrong. Well, we're on Xbox. Maybe we'll have a little more luck. Um, probably not. But worst case scenario, then we just get the damn thing from zero. Yeah, sorry zero. You're gonna die anyway. I'm gonna take it from you. Get off your cold ass corpse. I like how they uh, made the uh, Buster uh, shot like different between. Uh... Oh, sorry, it's normal and difficult. So but anyway, but uh, yeah, I like how they made the shots different in Maverick Hunter X. Uh, do you have a preference where to start? No. Oh right. Oh, still pressing start here. That kind of makes sense. <laughs> I remember my friend could do that, but I could never really put it off. How do you do it again? Uh, it was holding either the, uh, jump or fire both, uh, like, while the, um... All the things going, yeah. You select it, yeah. I just held both, because I forgot which. <laughs> ah, crap. Yeah, it's the thing about, like, you know, playing Mega Man games for so long. People will be like, oh, I bet you know a lot. And it's like, man, I've forgotten a lot. <laughs> Yeah. 
So it's like, yeah, both are true, and they are not exclusive. Those, uh, spikes look like they have faces. Wait, what? I'll show you later. I always call these pine cones. At least my brother and I did. I can see the reasoning there. Oh, crap. I thought I was done. You're never done with the pine cones. They spread their seeds. But yeah, it's like if we played uh, X on Super NES, I'd never get the achievement. Hi, I'm a mi I'm a one up. You can't reach. How are you doing today? Screw these things. Oh. Hey, I can just give you a big power up. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot that just kind of instantly kills them. Crap. No, my entertainment. I just wanted to entertain the children. I am the clown who cried. Wow, he wasn't hurting nobody. And he won't ever again either. Um, um, right. that's, a, that's usually, uh, yeah. Well, if I had an item, I'd be able to do it, but... But we don't. I was gonna say use the cutter. Oh yeah, you don't have it. <laughs> I can't remember if anything beats those things. Uh, I forget too. Get bent, gear clown says Lyra. Goddamn <laughs> right. I thought Metal Man was like a doctor or something. <laughs> he kind of looks it, doesn't he? Yeah. Open wide, bitch. Here comes your tonsillectomy. Yay! No pickups in this one. Do we want to do one more stage? Nah, I'm good. I could probably take out Flashman real quick. I'm good. Let's see. Lance says, also my reflexes are already slowing. Muscle memory is lie in my case. Yeah, I feel that sometimes too. I feel that a lot of the time. Press the button says, quick and bubble kill those things. Okay. Uh, I thought I was thinking quick man could, but I couldn't remember. I forgot about bubble. Shotty came at him like a Mega Man boss. <laughs> Scarab says, quote, no, I'm not a dentist. Uh, Lyra, violent dancing. Get equipped, says B. Barry. And with that. All right, so yeah, I guess that's going to do it. That's uh, Mega Man Mayhem for the 35th anniversary of Mega Man, right? Yeah, we uh, didn't think we beat Mega Man, but we did. But then again, we made liberal use of the... Uh... But you know what? I don't care. <laughs> I really don't care. Yeah, it's, uh, we, we, we tried. Uh, I guess that's the important thing. I'm here to have fun. I'm not here to get bang my head on a wall. Yeah, but I, th I think being able to, like, you know, actually, you know, do it legit well, is kind of fun in its own it'll way. We'll probably be fine with the event, too. At least we do it mostly legit. Yeah. The only thing I can imagine is, like, really needing to, uh, like, you know, screw around with is, um, the uh, friggin' boo beam traps. Hmm. Anyway, yeah, so this will be it. Tingo, what are you? Ow. I have a big orange cat who just, like, climbs over me and makes sure to step on me with every paw. Alright, so yeah, um, yeah, thanks for coming out, everyone. This is Mega Man Mayhem. Uh, I mean, I know we did the one uh, before with Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3, but yeah, this is the one that's, like, really kind of kicking off this, kicking it off as a series, so to speak. So, um, keep an eye on the Twitters and, uh, all that fun noise and you know, places where you found out about this. I'll spread the word the next time we do it. Probably do another stream another time, like maybe the Genesis Mini 2 or something. Yeah. Uh, Got to make sure that uh, thing even works. Um, but uh, yeah, we'll probably do that next time and then come back to this because we do the streams bi-weekly and, you know, about one, once a month seems good here. Mm -hmm. And we'll pick up Mega Man 2. Uh, in the meantime, you can find me on Twitter. Um, well... Yeah, uh, at LBD underscore N-Y-T-E-T-R-A-Y-N and at the MM Network uh, for the MMNetwork.com, the Mega Man Network, which uh, we've got a new design going over there and the site's working a bit better. Old articles and comments and images and a lot of stuff's like working now. 
Uh, it took us a while to get here, but, you know, it's a first big step, and hopefully it's the beginning of more great things to come. Mm-hmm. Uh, I also uploaded the uh, a personally significant uh, chapter uh, episode of uh, Legends of the Halcyon Era over there and on Archive of Our Own, uh, which, you know, I've got notes there that explain why, but I definitely made it a goal to have it up today, if no other day. Like, if nothing else is going to happen, I want that to be up today. And, uh, let's see. Yeah, uh, you'll be... If you missed uh, some of this, you'll be able to find it on uh, the Nightworks YouTube channel later. And uh, hopefully I can get an edited version for the Mega Man Networks YouTube channel, which really needs content, so YouTube actually remembers it exists. <laughs> uh, where can they find you, Nadia? Uh, I'm on Twitter at Nadia Oxford for now. I'm on co-host. I've been doing a little blogging there, also at Nadia Oxford, so uh, go ahead and check that out if you want. Um, I usually put up links to my blogging over on Twitter, so, you know, cross-pollination there anyway. Uh, part of the Axe of Blood God crew. It's an RPG podcast. We cover RPGs, old, new, eastern, and western. I also do Charlotte Dropout, which is a Final Fantasy XIV podcast. I do Retronauts, which is a retro podcast. I do a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, yeah, uh, but if you want to talk to me, just come to me on Twitter. I'll, I'll say hi. All right, and I also want to give a couple of special uh, thanks, shout outs to Victor Campen for the. Uh artwork he's been providing for me for the uh, legend stories and uh, also Matthew Means who got the site going again so uh, it's going to be exciting to move forward again with that sure. and uh, we're revamping the other sites in a similar form as well just weren't able to make it happen today but uh, those will be coming soon and uh, anyone else who want to give a special shout out to I think we're good everyone for joining us thank you and Capcom all staff for Mega Man and you <laughs> As Mega Man X. And yeah, thanks to all of you for coming out and uh, joining us on this 35th anniversary stream. And we hope to see you here next time. Goodbye and good night.